First of all, the first thing I see is like another episode of Alter and today the place I'm currently standing in front of is Mustafa Center and it's kind of familiar to most of you guys right so the producers today have challenged me to style some of the pieces like the fashion pieces inside and to be very freaking honest right I never go inside a shop before like I only go there to walk walk when I got nothing better to do so today is probably gonna be a challenge because I have no idea what to expect as with most of these styling videos lah. so let's just head inside to see what they have um, because uh, very loud here lah, very noisy you know I cannot I cannot talk already I repeat this intro like maybe 20 times already, okay? We just go inside, huh? Okay, bye! <laughs> okay, we are currently inside Mustafa Center and first of all, I would like to say that they have like basic crop tops. Hello? Oh my god, how much is this? It's $6.90. Also, please ignore the killing me softly in the background. It's low-key killing me softly and it's just going to repeat for the entire video. So, I'm sorry. They also have like other colours as well. Oh, they also have different shapes. Oh, I like this purple one. This is nice. I like this. Wait, where's the mirror? Okay, there's no mirror. Never mind. Another thing that I saw, which is this denim peasant dress, which has like the ruching in the, in the centre that splinters your waist. Also look very like something... Not bad, not bad actually. I don't like this I don't like these bobble thingies here. But other than that, I think something like this is not very outdated to be very honest. If anything it's been brought back in trend. Anyway, this area, this section that I walk through is like a huge like open space full of like pants. But this section is for the ladies and I think they have like cute like bottoms. Okay, this not cute, it's very functional bottoms. These are like $8.90. I would say 100% you can wear these for like exercise or like home shorts or even like for myself I might consider getting like these like three quarter pants for like dance. Not bad. I think quite worth, quite worth. Okay so in this section right they also have like a lot of very commonly cited brands like Levi's, Pierre Cardin. Uh, they even have like sportswear brands like Nike, Puma, Adidas and stuff like that here. But I feel like the pieces they have are not the kind that are at the on sale or like those factory outlet style they are still average pricing or even the price that people will actually pay in store for it I walk towards the shoe sec shoe, she 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 shoe section I walk towards the shoe section um, to be very honest I don't really like anything that I see here like like I can't I can't imagine myself wearing this though I think that that someone might be able to pull this off with jeans but that someone is not me today. <laughs> okay, I found something that is very throwback to my 2006-2007 style. These sandals are like bijou but they are black. And then they come in this like plasticky material, right? Last time when I was younger, I used to always wear these like plastic sandals with like NF shorts and like a t-shirt. Yeah, that was my style, just saying. Speaking of the bijou or plastic slippers, right? My mum used to ban me from wearing those types of outfits out. Because she said it's too revealing for like a 14, 15 year old. Which is true. And at the point, I was just trying to attract my uh, online audition boyfriend. <laughs> but she really used to ban me. Like, I had tube tops. She would confiscate my tube tops, okay? And then like, store it away. Then I had to secretly like, wear out underneath my t-shirt and change clothes. But don't lie lah, y'all convert got to be for one. Your mother convert got strict. And then you convert change clothes when you go outside one. Don't lie. <laughs> So this is the producer special when she came here to Reiki, she was like, Oh my god, I think this is a steal. Like, I bought one for myself because it's a top and bottom for $18. For those yoga enthusiasts or like spin class or class pass enthusiasts, if you ever want a matching set for $18, I think it's quite worth to be very honest. The material is not bad as well and they got different colours so the other colour that my producer got, which is this, the grey and the white, for your consideration everybody. I feel here has a, a bit of the Pasamalan street market vibe which um, I think nothing wrong it's just that I mean if y'all can see la, the print itself definitely something I wouldn't wear but Bopian right? Okay so I spy something that I may not originally have thought out to pick out but as the camera stopped rolling I looked at it I was like hmm this actually might work which is this uh, green pastel green a um, multi-coloured kind of like top. Oh, they have pink also. They have pink, purple, like orange. 
They have like multi multi-purpose colors, not multi-purpose, yeah. They have a lot of multi-colors of these tops. Variety, variety. I take the purple, let's go. Oh my god, they got matching pajama sets. Look at these. It comes with shorts also. Oh my god, look at this. Very sexy pajama top and bottom. Okay, we are at a section where my producer calls it the thrift shop section. And when I walk here, I totally realize why. Because they have like all of the maybe like more winter wear stuff and even like the bomber jacket style like all these like very winter clothes also looks very utilitarian so the first thing actually that caught my eye was hello mr vest over here um the number of times that people have asked me where do i buy vest from right in my dms is a lot especially when i wear this gray vest that i have they always ask me where is it from where is it from now i always say it's a thrifted mess so now if y'all want to buy vest you can come to mustafa because they have like black ones khaki ones they even have like more printed ones inside some are padded which i suggest obviously not so how are this is the blue one that i saw just now black or blue okay it doesn't mirror here <laughs> i cannot see what <laughs> I just go on down and see the video. So there's a couple of knitted vests here and these are pieces that I see coming back into style and I see a lot of people like my age or younger than me uh, wearing types of knitted vests like this. They have the grandpa one. I can't reach it, I'm short. <laughs> my gentle monster sunglasses. <laughs> so um, I picked out two of the vests um, after the unfortunate situation where everything fell on my head um, these are the two that I've picked out I really like this one because it's the very typical grandfather um, vest style the most important thing is I got a lot of items here right I think we need to calculate how much we're going to spend first because I got budget and I'll see you guys when I'm done shopping It's a new day and today I'm going to show you guys what I got from Mustafa So I got it all in this bag right here Okay, so the first thing I got is actually this purple top over here And uh, when I saw it at first, right, I was actually like uh, It does really give me like grandma or auntie at the coffee shop kind of vibes But I really actually like the colours for some reason The more I looked at it hanging there, the more I was like Hmm, maybe this could work Okay, and then next up what I have is something to match with the purple top which is this purple basic um, tank top crop top thing and um, this was $6.90 so $7 for this I think uh, about the range that people might often pay for basics but if you go to like maybe H&M or something it'll probably be like about $10 so um, this one for $7 I think it's alright okay and the third item I have okay this one I'm pretty excited about is this uh, grandpa um, stout sweater. It's called an Argyle Vest. Um, the colours, I wish it was a little bit brighter, but I think like the navy and the grey um, is very easy to match. La. Yeah, and this is $17.90. So I think the price for this, um, I think it's alright because nowadays I see a lot of like online stores, they sell vests for easily $25 and above. So the next piece that I got is this black utility style vest. Yeah, so the, the typical stores that you see uh, in your malls, I don't really see styles like this. So I think for twenty four fifty, I think the quality is great, and I think that um, because it's not really easy to find, um, I would highly recommend this actually. So if it sells out, Mustafa, I will tell you in advance. And the last thing I got, um, this one, I'm actually a little bit skeptical because I don't know how it's going to look on me. I didn't try it, but I decided to step out of my grungy and typical dressing uh, to go for this um, bohemian style dress okay denim dress that uh, I keep in mind um, I like that the dress is tiered I do wear tiered dresses pretty often because I think uh, dresses like this are very flattering okay and that kind of concludes the haul so I got five pieces and I'm gonna be styling uh, four outfits for you guys so I brought some of my own pieces to match together with these to show you guys how I can style it to make it more um quote unquote fashionable like, huh? like how the segment is supposed to be stay tuned for the lookbook which is coming up next
Shopee and Shopee and Mustafa was a pretty surprising. So I would say that the pieces that I picked out today, um, I don't think I would naturally gravitate towards them if I was shopping them by myself. But I think that it's more of like, okay, how do I make something uh, that may not necessarily be what I go for um, look nice? And uh, from the pieces that I actually picked out, I think my favourite outfit was the purple outfit. I think that, that gave me like a whole look, you know, because I wanted to make it um, a bit nostalgic, that's why I went with like flare pants. But I feel like from the five pieces, my favourite item was actually the black vest. It would be very useful to style up or style down um, multiple different outfits. And I think to conclude um, this whole experience, right, I would say go and check it out for yourself. Maybe you could find a gem of an item uh, in the huge stacks of items that they have uh, lying around in the store. So if you guys actually head to Mustafa to buy some of the pieces from there and style them, please 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 tag me in the photo on IG if you post a pic or you can leave a comment down below and let me know what other stores to style and don't forget to also like, share and subscribe and I'll see you guys on the next episode.